My sister's asking more about beautification. She wants to know uh, about the eyebrows. She says, when I was little and younger and was not religious, I used to pluck my eyebrows and make them very thin and so forth. And now I understand that it's haram to make my eyebrows thin. I stopped plucking, uh, but I've noticed that they're getting very thick and they're joining together. She says, I've heard before in, in Askoda that this is allowed on conditions. Um, what do I do? Am I allowed to pluck just one or two just so they don't look strange or they don't join together in the middle? Well, the scholars say that the area in the middle is not considered to be from the eyebrows. Mm. So she has the green light to remove that mm. uh, uh, hair in that area. Mm. But what's not permissible is for her to beautify herself by plucking, by cutting, or by shaving. Unless one or two hairs become harmful, they come in, inside her eyes or they uh, forbid her from uh, uh, seeing then in that case, it is okay to remove what is harmful, not what is ugly. And alhamdulillah, now medication and, and beautiful, uh, new materials are uh, uh, in, uh, in the market where you can use oxygen or some sort of chemicals that makes the color of uh, uh, the eyebrows close to the color of your skin. So bleaching is allowed? Bleaching it's, is allowed? It's okay. It's, uh, the Prophet ﷺ told us not to uh, uh, remove the hair by shaving or by cutting or plucking it but he did not say anything about uh, uh, bleaching it.